Winters Mill held on against Westminster for the second time this season, and the Falcons stayed in the county championship hunt. South Carroll added a win over FSK, and Man Valley defeated Hereford going away. On to the boys' hoops' top scorers from the past week. Brendan Luddy led the Mavericks to that win Friday with 29 big points. Tonic Zitta netted 24 for the Owls against Eastern Tech, and South Carroll's Micah Puckett had 20 on Monday against Middletown. The boys' basketball county standings are up to date. You see Man Valley leads the pack. The Mavericks have already clinched at least a tie of their first ever county title. Winners Mill can share it with them if the Falcons beat South Carroll on February 20th. Upcoming boys' games now. It's out-of-county matchups for a few days. Century hosts Mount Hebert on Thursday. Then we have Man Valley and Liberty both on the road. Don't forget South Carroll visits Winners Mill in a big game next Tuesday. That game between the Cavaliers and the Falcons is a big one. Like I said, CM Sportsnet plans to give you coverage of that matchup. Now we turn to girls basketball and we see some recent results from the hardwood. Man Valley picked up a big win over a Hereford team that was 15-1 going into the game. And from last Friday, the Owls and Cavaliers picked up wins and the Lions outlasted the Knights in overtime on February 8th in a good game there. On to the top scoring performances from the past week, FSK's Drew Watkins poured in 34 points in the Eagles win over Smithsburg. Harley McKee had big games for the Cavaliers, and Reese Crestline led Man Valley in their win over Hereford. The Carroll County girls basketball standings show county champ Westminster with the top record at 10 and two, and four girls teams have winning records overall with the regular season winding down. Just like the boys, we have some girls games of note coming up that have county teams crossing county lines. The Lions and Owls are both on the road along with Century, while Winters Mill gets Wild Lake at home on Thursday. Four teams have one county game to go before the regional playoffs get set in two weeks, so stay tuned for CM Sportsnet coverage of much more with girls basketball. Now we go to wrestling, where the county is already in postseason mode. Recent wrestling results time, South Carroll had a week of postseason success last week. You see how the Cavaliers earned a third straight dual state championship at CP Middletown in the 1A state final on February 10th in Waldorf. The county wrestling standings are up to date, and you see South Carroll unbeaten at 26-0. Car Carroll County flexing its muscle, continuing to flex its muscle, as six of the seven teams had winning records overall in duels. Pretty impressive. Want more local sports coverage? Be sure to like us on Facebook and subscribe to our YouTube channel.